Welcome everybody. I want to congratulate each one of you for joining us. It is a competitive process joining our program. Y'all have been awesome. Please give each other a round. Each one of you fellows, I want you to take advantage of this opportunity. We don't need you to be perfect. We just need you to work hard. Work hard at making friends, work hard at being a good person, and work hard at discovering what kind of artist you are. I was not expecting to get into CAM. Didn't really think I stood much of a chance in like the Memphis area. It was validating, I guess. Big shock to me, I was happy. My parents were very happy for me. I was nervous, very nervous. Also, I didn't really think I was gonna speak to too many people, but I, I was talking a whole bunch. I was very talking to, to everyone. <laughs> I made a lot of connections with artists. Uh, I never really had artistic friends. We're all in the same space for the entirety of the day, so you're going to find your tribe, basically. I met people who were like me, and like we were striving towards the same thing. We text each other like what we're working on, and like we give tips on how we can improve. That friendship created like empathy within each other. We really built a connection, which is really amazing. I was just really happy there was a printmaking class because I've never done that before, and I've been interested in it. Definitely pushed me out of my comfort zone to a new level with my art. It was also a really like, great community building experience and being around professional artists was very new to me. The instructors were hands-on about how to improve our work in certain like specific areas. If you look at your paper, if any kind of image source that you have or anything that you draw from, the drawing at some point becomes separate from it and becomes its own thing. So you have to think about the drawing and how it exists and what it needs from you in terms of mass, contour, gesture, okay? I'm thinking about composition, I definitely improve in like technical skill, which I'm like happy about. Like I thought there was one set fixed idea of what art should be and how an artist should be. But with Cam, my mindset changed completely about what art is. Like it doesn't matter about like your technical skills or how good you are. And that's what was setting me back. Like the idea behind the art is what matters most and how it inspires people and how it creates conversation and how you can express your ideas the best. At first, I didn't really think about putting ideas into my paintings. They really pushed that. They just pushed us to be the best version of ourselves. And I'm so grateful for that. Look, there's the work that you do in your studio, that you make, and then there's a the work around it. You already started that, because y'all got friends, y'all know each other. This is part of your first network, but it starts right here. Be very kind to each other. What's been your favorite part so far? I like the printmaking class. Printmaking? Like the food! <laughs> the food, yes! <laughs> so good. Yeah, really good to see y'all tonight, man. I hope y'all had a great day today. Um, dessert tonight's gonna be something special. Oh, I know this! Oh, my I, I had never even known some of the places that we had been to and it was in Memphis. It's not gonna be me telling you anything, it's gonna be you telling me what you see and what you think. Cause I know you're gonna be going to some museums in New York. And I didn't know that there was that much art here in Memphis and that there were artists in Memphis either and that really inspired me. It definitely changed my perspective on like the art scene here. It just opens you up to a lot of different opportunities in your area and in your community. I didn't really even think about going to galleries before, but now I'm like seeking out galleries to go to, look at new art and see what other people are doing and what I can do different. It's so great to be with you all because I see the enthusiasm with which you walked in and soaked up 
the art in here is, is incredible and it's the, exactly the right response. You know, <laughs> don't wait till you're invited, just go boom, in for it. I was really excited. Like I've been dreaming of going to New York since I was little. You get to see a completely different way of living than you're used to. It was crazy. We went to so many different places. We met so many different artists. Like it was, it was the best. They're so, so inspired. They're so I really love how you speak about your art. Like, it's just like so impressive. Like, you just seem like you make your art for you, and, mm -hmm. and I really love it. I really like admire you for that. Making the work is the thing that is the most fun, but it's more the emotional and personal challenges within finding confidence. There's not a lot of models of like being an artist, you know, so like it's really what you put into it. You know, and you just have to, you have to put yourself in the environments that you want to be in. You know, you have to surround yourself with people that you want to be like meeting artists that were successful and happy and living the life they wanted. And I'm like, oh, I can do that too. You just have to follow your instincts. Give yourself the time to figure out what actually feels right. A lot of this work comes with time. I, I mean, like, I liked art before, but didn't really see a career for myself because I didn't think making money off art was a real possibility before this. And now I'm seeing all these options, like, you can do art. Like I said, you don't have to be a visual artist to be a maker or a creator or love art or be a part of it. There's so many different opportunities within the art world. It is a world. You might end up a, a curator, you might end up a programmer, you might end up this thing or that thing, but all of that is informed by like how much you digest and take in art. The absorption of art has been the most important thing for me to be able to create build your network, but really the way to build your network is to be a friend of artists. Support your friends. I still talk to a lot of people from CAM. There's still like an open line of communication. If I need help with anything, it's not like it's just indie. You got advisors, you got me. I'm gonna be with y'all until, right? Call me whenever. Take what you got, change your school, change your teacher. Make them believe in what you got going, right? Pour into the students next to you, right? We are a community no matter where we at. I appreciate y'all. I love y'all. Yeah. Yeah.